and Bitcoin cash bulls forced a breakout past $230 last week and propelled prices as high as $256. Yet their momentum waned on Monday, 2nd October, and the price was swift to slump toward the $230 support zone. A previous analysis from AMB Crypto of Bitcoin Cash's price action highlighted the bullish market structure shift. The article noted a push toward $250 and higher was possible. While we got a move to $250, uh, the bulls couldn't sustain further gains. Uh, will they rest and recharge uh, before forcing another move northward? Uh, the $220.3, $228 region was a former bearish order block from the 29th of August. It was broken and retested as a bullish breaker block on 27 September. However, the market structure on the four hour chart was bearish as the recent low at 232.8 is cracked. A set of Fibonacci retracement levels was clotted based on the late September BCH rally, which showed the 61.8 and 78.6% retracement levels were at $222.7 and $213.05, respectively. The confluence of the breaker block with the 61.8% level meant that the $222.230 region was a hefty demand zone the bears might not be able to fracture. The shift in the H4 market structure was accompanied by a drop in the relative strength index below neutral 50. Uh, the unbalanced volume, which had been trending higher, Died lower over the past two days. Uh, despite these developments, it could be profitable to buy Bitcoin Cash. Uh, at the $222, $230 region, uh, targeting the $256 and 23.6% extension level at the $269 to take profit. And uh, not only was the market structure in the lower time frames bearish, but the sentiment was as well. And the pullback saw a drop in the open interest. Um, Together, the falling prices and always signal bear sentiment. Uh, moreover, the spot cumulative volume delta like the OBV also clummeted downward to indicate enormous selling pressure in the spot markets. This was an ominous sign for buyers, especially risk-averse ones. Hence, instead of buying BCH at the demand zone mentioned above, traders can also wait for the one-hour chart to flip its structure bullishly before looking to enter long positions. Uh,